How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to the Boogeyman. So, full disclosure, this is actually the second attempt of this recording because I accidentally, continuously skipped cutscenes. I need to find a way for me to not press shift because that kind of did it in. It's a bathroom. I'm st I still get lost, though, so it's like... Okay. So I kind of know where to go right now. That's here. No. No, it's not. It's... What's in this room? Oh, wait, what? Okay, I never went in there, actually. I know I have to interact with this book to do anything, but... Uh, I didn't really interact with anything else in this room before I ended up triggering a cutscene. A few books are stacked up. They seem to be about history. And then here's the book that we have to interact with. History of Castle Livingstone. Tyrant. It's the one highlighted. Held in. Kill them. Torture them. What? Eh. Hey, surprise. Excuse so me? Where you were. Yeah, excuse me? What was I just reading? Sorry for wandering in here. Oh, no, no. I don't mind. Oh, uh, okay. Such a large study, isn't it? I used to play hide-and-seek in here as a kid, and my dad always told me off. So many piles of old, precious books, too. Unfortunately, I don't really know how much they're worth. Well, that's upsetting. Is that book about the history of the castle? Probably, I'd assume. Ah, you've been doing some reading. A very disturbing history, isn't it? Just a little bit, yeah. The former lord of the castle was quite the tyrant. He severely taxed the islanders and persecuted anyone who rebelled. There are many odd rooms in this castle, actually. I'm sure they were used for punishment. Eh, but you'll be toured through them tomorrow, so... Oh. You said you managed this place yourself. Must be hard. Well, only as of late. I went to film school, actually, and did some work in Hollywood. I'm gonna say this much. Keith sounds dead. It wasn't too long ago I returned here. After my parents' death, I inherited the property, you see. Brendan here on the other one, who's talking right now. He don't sound so much dead. Yes, it's a hard job to do alone, especially with all those strange rooms. So I thought I'd promote this place as a tourist destination. Okay, okay. I'm not too interested in the castle myself. I'd hate to live out the rest of my days in a deserted place like this. Anyone would. Let's be honest. This tour is kind of a test drive, you might say. And CB has been a great help with everything. That's nice. No need to worry. I'm sure it'll be a hit soon. Oh, yeah. No, I do hope you're right. Say, Mr. Baring, you're a detective, right? That's yep. so neat. I love police dramas, and I watch Law & Order all the time. That's not real. That's not real detective work. Sorry, but it's not a pretty job. Well, in the eyes of an ordinary citizen who blends into the crowd, I think it's swell. <laughs> I'm jealous. Hell, I'm jealous that you own a castle. Must attract a lot of girls. Yeah. Wait, <laughs> wait, what? Yes, it would. I'd love to meet a wonderful woman like you have. My well, first hand reaction... My first hand reaction is yeah, and my next reaction is like, wait, what? Okay, bye. This is actually... What's happening? Hey, David. You yeah. going to eat your banya powder? The bahada who wait what? Oh, uh, yeah. Maybe you can have it. Why don't you want it? It's delicious. He won't eat it because he hates anchovies. Well, that's picky. Really? That's why? That's so cute. I, I mean, it, it smells so raw. And hey, don't call me cute, okay? Cool would be fine. <laughs> Jeez, Helena's laughing too? <laughs> Everyone's laughing at you, David. Just like everyone laughs at me. Because it's cute, right, Shirley? If we're talking cute, I think that would be you, Missy. Aw, that's adorable. Pardon me, 
You can have the rest of it. The what? You won't be having any more? Um, no. Um. Gosh, Mr. Keith never smiles. What's um, got him in a tizzy? Yeah, that's a good question, Sophie. That is a very decently asked question. He's always that way. Elena? By this time, I actually kind of stopped playing because I accidentally skipped the cutscene again. Huh. What is he, a robot? Kind of seems like it. <laughs> a robot detective? So he's robo- Ow! Don't be rude. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was funny. Ah, uh, Robocop. I remember going to see that with my wife back in college. Wow. He may be that way now, but he used to be very funny, you know. He was always making me laugh. I told him he should consider being a comedian. Really? I don't believe it. That's... A uh, comedian or not, he's still the laughing stock of some magazines. You know about that, don't you, miss? Oh, God, don't. Hello? Keith, jeez, man, why don't you answer your call? I've been trying all day. It's a freaking vacation, Eric. What do you need? What do you do with the profiling info for the investigation? Ah, uh... It's on your desk. What? It's not there. It's not. It's nowhere. It's completely and totally... Oh, there it is! Eric? <sighs> is that when you called 20 times over? I called because you went on vacation without saying a word to me. Tell me before you hand this stuff over. I mean, why in the world would you take a vacation in a hellish time like this? And please, answer your calls. How many times do I have to tell you? Frankly, you should just clean up your desk. Hell, mine too. Papers are going to topple over. They'll start attracting flies. <laughs> it's not food. Man, I don't wanna. You do it, Keith. How dumb are you, Eric? If you don't have it cleaned up once I'm back, I'll burn it all. Oh my god. Oh, there he goes again. Quick to threaten, aren't we, Keithy? Sorry, I'll clean up. You better. So what's the situation over there? Oh my god, Keith! Ah, well, you see... Ah, oh, hey! Hey, how's it going? Having a good trip? <sighs> Hand it back to Eric. I don't need you right now. Harsh, harsh. You don't need Eric neither, all right? Now, just hang up and enjoy your trip. At least tell me the situation over there. Yeah, it can't happen. Situation, eh? Got no obligation to tell anyone who's not on the crime scene. Come on, Dick. You gonna ignore your honey again? What, you wanna try and investigate this over the phone? Boy, what's the point of giving you a vacation anyway? Yeah, he, uh, workaholic. That's a I problem. Sleep when I'm dead. Oh my god. I'm just saying, don't stick your neck into this. Plus, Eric's always relied on you too much. Now's the time to whip him into shape. Now, don't call again. Got it? I ain't gonna tell you nothing. I didn't do oh my god. Eric called me, not the other way around. Now go to hell. Same to you. So long. I hate that. Okay, so what do I do? Am I just supposed to go back inside? I have a blank field and... Yeah, it m must be that. Okay, going back to the... Wait, where's the dinner room? Not there. Here? Oh, well, there it is. Wait. Where's... Well, did you take some good pictures? Yeah, they're decent. You'll show us more tomorrow, yeah? Is there anywhere that's off limits? 
Uh, I haven't really asked Brendan about that. I'll check with him tomorrow. Can I... Um... Can someone tell me where Helena is? Max and Stevie are talking about tomorrow. So I said I wanted to see Robocop, but my wife said she wanted to see Platoon, and we fought and fought. Well, that's a tough one to choose from. Robocop and Platoon... Oof. Why'd you have to put two very good titles in the same sentence? In the end, Robocop won, but things were a bit stormy after that. I know how that goes. Shirley and I never want to see the same movies. A lot of the time, we come to the theater together, but then go our separate ways. Makes sense. That one piece looks really good on you. I'm glad I bought it for you. <laughs> this one's my favorite. Aww. Since you picked it out, of course. Shirley and Sophia are chatting. What is... David and Richard are talking. Okay, I get it. Alright, fine. I'll leave. So, where to... Storeroom? No, obviously not. Kitchen? Okay, I guess not. Um, where do I go? Well, no one... Everyone's still ignoring me, but, uh... Oh. Wait. Keith, you took your call? Y yeah... Were you just crying? I'm pretty sure I saw her hands like this. Were you just crying? Yeah. S sorry for for going back without you. I wanted to take a sh shower. You were just crying, weren't you? Uh, uh, I'm going to bed now. Good night. Wait, wait, hold on. Why wait. were you crying? Down. Oh no. If you say that, if the next thing you say is something I think you're gonna say, then I already know where this is going and I already don't like it. I want to talk for a bit. And you said it. <sighs> you want a divorce, don't you? I've read this story before. This kind of story before. Random. I want to talk with that tone leads to bad and you two are married so the only thing I can think of that would make sense for these kind of stories would be a divorce right I wanted to tell you this once we got back from this trip but it's too hard for me oh no yeah yeah that's what it has to be we're at a very important crossroads, a kind of D-Day. Yep, 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 nope, yep, I was right, I was right. D-Day. D-Day references Death Day, or Doomsday, and the only way a relationship can do that is, say a it. decision, I guess, or divorce. Yep. I've been thinking about it for a long time, but I couldn't say it. want a divorce? You're so monotone. Okay. You are so monotone, Keith. You are so freaking monotone. No, that's not it. No, I could hate you. I don't want to read these it's anymore. Not that. It's not you. It's a problem with me. Is it though? You. That's a lie. That's what everyone says. There's no way. Uh uh. I'm going to bed. We'll finish this conversation when we get home. Do you? Well, actually, no, yeah, she probably does. I, why? 
Why? That's such a... Told you, if I can just get some juicy tidbits, sales will shoot up for you, my man. Sheesh, didn't I tell you? I can't take photos of people. You can keep your money if you want pics of that rude ass detective. Um, what? Oh, yeah, his, his girl's alright. Oh, yeah, she's a good one. Gotta wonder why she's with a snooze fest like him. Hey! I mean, <laughs> not a bad not idea. I'd love to see him keep his cool even when his girl's taken. Wait. What? What did you just say? We're going to tour the island tomorrow, right? I can't wait. That's right, but you'd better get to bed soon so you can wake up tomorrow, yes? Yeah. Yeah. What are you saying, Papa? You gotta enjoy both days and nights on vacation, right? We should talk lots. Um, Papa needs sleep. <laughs> Why, we already spoke with the others plenty today, and I'm sure they're all going to... Oops, crap, crap. That wasn't supposed to happen. Now. There we go. Mm, but I didn't talk to you much, Papa. Come oh, on, my. Let's talk. <laughs> That's my selfish little girl. <laughs> Was Mama a good person? Did you and Mama get along like David and Shirley? Oh, God. We're going down this path. Oh, absolutely. I've never met a person finer than your mother. You're starting to remind me of her yourself, <laughs> though you'd need to be a bit more mature. Fair enough. She is a high school student, to be fair, so... So I can't be childish, huh? You... wait. What? You... You want to remind him of your mom? Now, Sophie, you can be whatever you want to be. No matter what, you're a precious family to me. A true treasure. Aww. And your mother as well, of course. Aww. <laughs> Got a text from Paul. Bring back souvenirs, you ass. <laughs> What's wrong? Doesn't Helena remind you of your mother? Uh, can we not talk about that? Maybe so. There's kind of that air about her now that you mention it. But what's this all of a sudden? Yeah, that was really random, but I remember a crooked man what happened with her. Can we please not talk about Never her? Never mind, I just had a thought. Surely, you can't do that. You don't look so good. Did something happen? Well, I've never been on a trip like this before. I don't know how I should act. It's different from traveling with friends, isn't it? Okay, fair enough. Hey, just enjoy yourself. You won't have any fun worrying over everything. We'll make some great memories. Aw. That actually sounds... Oh my god, okay. That sounds like something I'd say. I'm not even gonna lie. Some of the things that Richard said as well what actually your do. memories with me? What do you think? What do you think he meant by we'll make some great memories? We will. Him and you. We could always use more. I wonder how many more we need. Ah, uh, excuse you? Why don't we start now? Oh, look at the time. Better get to sleep. Hey, what about making memories? Oh my god. D David, no, not those kind of memories. <laughs> hey, David, stop it, I'm ticklish! <laughs> Give me a break, like that's gonna be a fond memory. <laughs> Good night. Enjoy yourself tomorrow. Night. Oh, come on, Shirley. That's not cool. That is not cool.
here. Okay. Oh my god, what? Somebody put a stop to that asshole's calls. Why do I get the feeling that's not him? Where's nope. my phone? That was definitely not him. Okay. And we've entered the scary. I don't know if I want to go look what. I don't know if you guys saw it, but I'm pretty sure a note just randomly appeared next to the... Like, right there. What the hell? Um, I'm, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna stay seated. I ain't moving anywhere. Cause... <laughs> I don't want to deal with this yet. We'll do it tomorrow. Um, but for right now, I am gonna leave this video here. So... This was a rough episode to get through, honestly. It wasn't... Not for the sense of, like, it was frightening rough, but that was... Those were some pretty rough topics there. Everyone ignored me anyway, so... Uh, <laughs> anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of The Boogeyman. If you liked it, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel. Have a suggestions for a horror game that you'd like me to do? Let me know in the comments below. Want to check out any other horror games that I've done prior to this one? I'll have a link to one across my head here. This game, however, will be up over that. In the meantime, I'm out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye! Ow. <laughs> Jeez. Bye!